Sikhism teaches us to live without fear and without hate. Sikhs are very peaceful people, yet courageous. We hope to see equality and acceptance for all religions and cultures. Sat Sri Akal, this is a greeting of world's fifth largest religion called Sikhism. Sikhi or Sikhism was founded in 1400s by Guru Nanak in the Punjab region of India. The word Sikh means a disciple or a student and the word Guru means a teacher. Sikhism is a monotheistic religion. It is the fifth largest religion in the world and it is practiced by approximately 30 million people worldwide. It is estimated that about half a million Sikhs live in the United States. American Sikhs have served in the United States military as far back as early 20th century. They have served in World War I and World War II. Sikhism has five articles of faith. Uh, first one being uh, your case, which is, means your uncut hair. The second one is Ganga, which is your hair comb to clean your hair. Third one is Kasara, which is your shorts for poverty and uh, you know, self-control. The fourth one is your Kara, which is meaning you're connected to God. And the fifth one is Karpan, which is a small sword for, for your protection as well as protection of others. Two significant colors in Sikh religion when it comes to turban is blue and orange. But nowadays, you'll see many different colors. Many of it's come as a fashion where people are matching their shirt colors with their turban colors. To a Sikh, a turban is his crown. It represents equality for everyone. After 9-11, an image appeared on every national TV of a man wearing a turban responsible for the attack of 9-11. Within months, there were approximately 300 racial bias attacks against Sikhs in the recorded in the United States. Just a few days after the attacks on 9-11, a Sikh man in Arizona was mistakenly identified as a terrorist and was shot and killed as a revenge attack. Another example of a hate crime against Sikhs that were committed was in Wisconsin when somebody came inside a Sikh Gurdwara house of worship and killed individuals and one of the officers that were first to respond was also shot but he survived the shooting. In predominantly Sikh neighborhoods, hate crimes are present to this day. Kids are bullied in school and harassed because of their faith or the way they look. The way 9-11 impacted the Sikh community was it gave us an opportunity to teach everyone who Sikhs are and what Sikhism is. So in 2016, we formed the Sikh Officers Association, which has been since recognized as an NYPD fraternal organization. Soon after the formation of the Sikh Officers Association, there was a big push to change the policy to wear a turban and a beard while on job. Policy changes by the NYPD regarding religious accommodation had a ripple effect on many big and small law enforcement agencies. We're hoping that by teaching about Sikhism, we can share our experiences, share our beliefs with other communities, other cultures, and celebrate these beautiful religions together. <laughs>